नमस्कार दोस्तों आज हमारे साथ एक पेशेंट और हैं एंड ही इज चंद्रशेखर जय चंद्रशेखर एंड अभी मैं हमारे हॉस्पिटल में हूँ कर्मा आयुर्वेदा में जहाँ पे हमारा फोर्टी वेडेड एनएबीएच हॉस्पिटल है एनएबीएच अप्रूव हॉस्पिटल है और ही इज फ्रॉम चेन्नई चेन्नई से आए हैं एंड ही इज कम्फर्टेबल इन इंग्लिश तो आई बी कॉन्वर्सिंग विद हिम इन इंग्लिश ओनली सो वेलकम टू कर्मा आयुर्वेदा मिस्टर चंद्रशेखर हाउ यू फीलिंग ओवर हेयर आई एम फीलिंग ग्रेट एंड दिस आई बीन यर फॉर लास्ट एट ईयर्स एट डेज एंड आई फील एट होम ओके आई डोंट फील लाइक आई एम इन हॉस्पिटल okay all staff doctors everybody are friendly and i'm uh, very happy to be here and uh, always thinking positive and going through the routine of uh, yoga going through the routine of therapy going through the routine of uh, acupressure acupuncture acupressure okay all these things so it's all going on time and food is also very tasty very lovely lovely in spite of the restricted uh, spices so i get enjoy the food also so everything is going on very well So, what were the creatinine level, Mr. Chandrasekhar, when you first visited us? Okay. See, the creatinine level uh, so far, highest for me, it has gone as two point eight. Okay, this is the highest two point eight value. And I, uh, apart from creatinine, I don't have any other uh, issues like burn or uh, ure urea okay. or any other uh, electrolytes. Everything has been normal right from beginning. But uh, somehow, uh, creatinine has been high. Uh, first, uh, I noticed this uh, is. Uh, Sometime around 2014, okay, last 10 years back, and that time there was some uh, statin uh, tablets given to me, and statin uh, had in, uh, pushed my creatinine level from somewhere around 1.6 uh, to 1.9 to two, and then uh, there was one again one uh, tablet given by a cardiologist which pushed uh, that and pain killers pushed my. Uh, Within one week, it pushed my creatinine from two to two point seven allopathy. Then I stopped taking allopathy totally, and uh, from that time, almost seven years, I'm taking eight years. I'm taking only only uh, Ayurvedic. Okay, I am fed up of uh, allopathy. Okay, at least allopathy doesn't suit me. So I uh, slowly uh, I first contacted few doctors in uh, Ayurvedic doctors in Chennai, and. Uh, those doctors uh, medicines were able to contain my level but not able to de decrease the creatinine value it they maintain my level okay it did not increase more decrease but i, I came to know about uh, karma ayurveda i joined karma uh, through website and 6 uh, months i've been taking treatment in karma ayurveda after i took treatment first time i could see my creatinine level going down from 2.8 to 2.5 And, and I have now joined the IPD. I have not taken report after joining the IPD. It is due for tomorrow. Tomorrow, once I take the report, I am sure I am expecting the creatine to come down at least by 0.3, 0.4, something like that, or touch uh, closer to two. If it comes closer to two, then I can maintain all the. Uh, now I am more aware, conscious of what uh, diet I have to take, what uh, medicine, how medicines I have to take. everything i'm pretty aware so i think i'll go on a specific routine i'll avoid outside food all those things and that should keep me a better uh, state as far as uh, controlling ckd is concerned definitely yes mr chandrasekhar and there has been a phenomenal improvement in case of mr chandrasekhar the creatinine level were quite high when he first visited us the when he first started the treatment wo lagbhag aapka creatinine was around 2.7 Yeah, two point eight. Sorry, two point eight. Two point eight was the creatinine level, and it has came down to one point seven during yeah. the six months of treatment. He has come down all the way from Chennai to Delhi to get the treatment from us, and there has been a phenomenal improvement. Last six months, he has been taking treatment, our treatment, and from the last eight days, he is he is staying with us in the IPD. And I will also request the camera person to just show the room so that people can come to know what all facilities we are providing in the uh, during the stay. There is a normal uh, single room with a bed. and all the amenities are there and the food is also very good wo kehte hain ki agar food acha hota hai to man zyada lagta hai food acha hone ka matlab spicy aur wo nahi hai khana acha hota hai to baki cheeze bhi sahi rehti hain taki khana man bhi santosht rahe aur aapki body bhi santosht rahe wo bahut zaruri hai mr chandrasekhar who has came all the way from chennai is having a great time and is feeling very well is recovering a lot would you like to add something along with this for all those patients who are also suffering from the ckd problem yeah. so i i uh... I want more people to uh, whoever is following allopathy to slowly move to Ayurvedic and take Ayurvedic treatment because Ayurvedic see people uh, when I approach a doctor 
uh, nephrologist, I asked him if I continue uh, uh, this thing, uh, allopathy, will he make sure that I do not get into dialysis? He said I cannot guarantee. So when he cannot guarantee that I uh, dialysis, that I cannot prevent dialysis, what is the point of going to allopathy? Then I thought I will continue with my Ayurvedic treatment right. and at least Ayurvedic there is a scope for me to decrease and at least stable, right. not too much of variation. Right. So, and I could see results here. In Karma Ayurveda I could able to see results in 6 months time. And I want to continue and I am sure I will become normal in another 6 months and I can, I can be like any other uh, person. And I, I, I can enjoy some uh, outside food after long, maybe in another one year I can do that. Sure. So that is what I hope uh, and I am under the good care of Dr. Puneet and uh, other doctors okay, under him. So they take care of me. Can you see the hands? We have got, the patient has gone through medicines, diet, yoga, acupressure and acupuncture. Suju also the patient has gone. Sujok. Sujok, yeah Sujok, Sujok, right. Sujok has patient has also done along with the acupressure. Acupuncture also you are doing acupressure, yeah. yoga bhi kar rahe hai. Kya routine hai ta aapka pura din ka yaha pe? What, yeah. what is the current routine yeah, that you are following throughout the day? Yeah, morning uh, we start the day with uh, kada. Okay. They bring the kada at uh, 7.45 or something. No, and no. then, uh, all right, please continue. Then we have uh, yoga. And then we do yoga for 45 minutes. And then after yoga, uh, I uh, get uh, breakfast. And uh, breakfast, this is for uh, renal uh, specific breakfast. I get the breakfast, and after breakfast, I uh, am called for therapy. So, there is uh, at least three, four therapies in a day for these patients. I, I uh, attend two therapies and uh, undergo two therapies in daytime, and uh, post lunch, I get attend another two therapies completed. In between, I take some rest. And uh, just now, before this uh, video call, I had uh, fruits. And I, I took fruits and then around 1 30 I'll get lunch so I'll finish my lunch and then uh, night time I'll uh, get chapati chapati I get about 8 8 chapatis plus sabji for lunch and dinner evening again we have uh, routine yoga continuing for another 45 minutes I go for a stroll and then we have in the garden we have uh, some specific type of stones where we walk on the huh? reflexology okay yeah. so where we walk uh, for uh, Improving uh, our uh, diabetes, reducing our diabetes and improving our blood circulation, blood circulation everything. So that we continue and we also chat with uh, some other uh, patients and uh, staff as well because they are very friendly with us and uh, we go about uh, our daily routine this way and we get good sleep also because the environment it's very important that uh, uh, to be to get a good sleep we have to be positive and we get the positive attitude here and we get the right type of people to be mixed with so I am able to sleep well. Chali, that's a very good thing and um, Mr. Chandrasekhar is actually from Chennai and it's a very very, very long journey from Delhi to Chennai. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. So you are you're feeling that the, the changes in the reports were there and the improvements were there which led him to come all over to Delhi and stay here for around 8 to 10 days. So how long is your stay from here? After these eight days, so after this, I'm just uh, planning to go to Uttarakhand okay. for a few days, okay. and then back to Chennai. All right, all right. Yeah. It was a nice talking to you, and we hope that you fully recover and just follow everything. What what we are uh, prescribing from here, including medicines, diet, yoga, exercises. You're going to see with God's grace, you're going to see good changes. Thank you. Thank you so much.